This flutter navigation bar is designed with Material U, and I will show you how to create this with your Flutter app. I will also show you how to remove the label and how to change the style of this navigation bar. The first thing you need to create is a custom text style. I have the font size, the weight, the spacing, and the font style. Now we create the first variable, current index, that we set as zero. And under this one, we have a list of widget, which we will call pages, and this will be a list of text. So we have the text echo, we have the text home, person, and video. All these widgets will use the text style that we have created. With this, we can create the body of our scaffold. We start with the center, and inside the child, we will have the pages with the current index. This will show in the middle of the screen the text echo, home, person, or video, and all will be controlled with the navigation bar that we will create. It's now time to create the bottom navigation bar, and for this we will use the widget navigation bar. The argument selected index will be the current index, the undestination selected will give us the new index, and with this we can set state and say that the current index is now equal to the new index. The argument destination will be a list of widgets. Inside, we put the navigation destination. I will create a selected icon. This one will be the icon.eco. The icon will be the icon eco outlined, and the label will be eco. And now you can see that we have an error because we need at least two navigation destination. So now I will create other navigation destination. We will have four of them. With this, we can already click on the navigation bar and we will see the body change for different text. And to customize the style of the navigation bar, you can change the background color, the animation duration, the label behavior. By example, if you want to remove the labels, you can also put only show selected. So you will have the label only when it's selected. And and you can also change the height of the navigation bar. If you want, you can wrap the navigation bar with the navigation bar theme. Inside you have the data argument. You can put the navigation bar theme data. With this, you can change the indicator color. You can see that now you have a white opacity 50 and you can change the label textile also if you want. So this is how to create a Flutter navigation bar with the material you design. But do you know what is even better than this navigation bar? You can click this video on the screen right now and I will show you my top 35 Flutter tips and tricks that will absolutely blow your mind. So that's it for this one. See you in the next video. Bye.